Hey guys, hello, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog. So, if this is your first time seeing this beautiful face, you're most definitely welcome. Hi, my name is Bernice, but you can call me Breezy, okay? And I'm just gonna do a random vlog. Anything in particular for this vlog, I'm just gonna take you guys around with my life. And yeah, I see a lot of people like it on my channel, so we're gonna be doing some more vlogs, okay? but yeah today's friday i just come off um i just got off from a training a work related training you know i got a new job that requires me to do cpr and first aid so i just did that and now i'm coming to dmv which i'm dreading because if you know me i don't like going to public slash government buildings because they're slow as hell but hopefully i will find favor and i will be lucky enough to get this done asap it's now 130 no 127 hopefully i'll get that and it's enough rambling i can't take my camera in there but let's go to dmv so guys one hour later i'm done with dmv for now because um i still need to go back home to get uh paperwork for exportation i did export um my car before and somebody wasn't doing their job right so they didn't input it in the system correctly so now they have to make me go do it i'm so pissed you know because they took part of my tax okay they took my money and it was a lot of money, over five hundred dollars. So I need my money back. So that's why I'm going home. But I don't know. I still have post office run to do, and I need to come back here before four. So instead of sitting here talking to myself with this camera, I need to get going. Okay, I'm super hungry, and I have the kids at home still. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. But let's see, guys. It's 4.22 now. So tell me why I had to do the whole damn God knows how many hours dealing with DMV. Oh, the good thing is everything I came to do, I got it done. <coughs> <coughs> so I had to go back. So I had to go back home to get um, the paper and I did and came back and that won't take forever. But I'm happy I'm done with them. The only person I have to deal with now is um, going to be the post office. Because, oh, in case I didn't tell you all. So, I am currently in the process of changing my name. Okay, since I got married, I'm only changing my name now. Like, after what, two years, almost three years? I'm only changing my name now. So, I'm officially now additional Sawyer on all my... Um, document and stuff so yeah but um i'm hungry as hell i only had breakfast and i had just one bagel so now let's go into my favorite restaurant and get um lunch so i'm here this is my favorite restaurant um my favorite um like local restaurant sandwich shop and they have a lot of um different location but this particular location i don't know they make their food different so i'll show you guys around right now so this is the story of the restaurant i'm just reading it now i think i just put this up like yesterday or something okay well now and uh, i feel like i'm family here so but I'm really tired. I'm really exhausted. I'm exhausted, I'm tired, and I'm gonna be having lunch, dinner, whatever it is right now, so. But yeah, I'm just driving now, um, listening to Gina Monet. I'm so into vlogs now. I think that's why I'm so inspired to do my own vlogs and stuff. And yeah, next I'm going to the salon. 
guys i feel like i've just been talking to myself in this car i feel like the first half of this vlog all you see is me in this car and maybe when i went to the restaurant <sighs> i hate when people just vlog and it's just their face saying the stuff so i'm gonna show you okay i'm going to get gas now and my car i'm tired this adult thing it's not easy it is not easy one freaking bit omg i'm oh lord i came somewhere passing on this road i need to see this lady she's sick and she has been looking forward to see me but man i've just been so busy and i need to go see her because i'll hit for something bad to happen and i've not um been there to see her so i'm gonna go see her not today hopefully on sunday yeah i'm gonna give her son a call she's elderly so yeah she's my she's my darling she likes me so much so yeah but um let's go get the gas and go to the salon okay that's all see i told you guys i i feel like i'm so boring right now like i don't have a lot going on you know but hey they say just keep doing it and you'll get better at it because i'm such a perfectionist that a lot of things i want to do i've held back because i feel like i've not done them well like guys you need to see my memory card uh, um with so many clips that i just feel like i don't want to put out but I'm trying to overcome that mentality, you know, because um, practice makes perfect, you know, we learn from mistakes and I have to, you know, keep showing up, you know, even if it's not the best of the best, in my opinion, you know, I just need to keep showing up. I feel like I'll get better and better each time, but yeah, I see no fumbling and my battery is dying. Oops, my battery is dying, so I'll talk to you soon. So I made it to the salon. Feels weird holding this camera for real, for real. But I'm just doing a pedicure today. I told y'all I hate to just say stuff and not show you. So here's it. hey guys guess what today is Saturday and it's six o'clock and I'm only getting out of my house right now like today has been a very very lazy day I low-key do not like my lip gloss for real for real I'm just looking at myself there but genuinely I don't like my lip gloss I like the second coating I think the pink one that I put underneath it's something that will go better if I have makeup on not like but anyways guys um today i was just home cleaning having a lazy day very lazy day now i'm heading to i don't even know where i think i'm heading to costco first then i'm going to maybe have dinner somewhere um my son i dropped him off at his um, friend's house he didn't want to go with me so what can i do you know so yeah uh let's go to costco maybe to be honest, I have freedom right now, but I don't know what to do. The reason is, so, um, originally I was, um, supposed to go have my, um, nails done. Nails done today, and then I bailed out because a friend of mine called me like, hey, let's go to Oakland and stuff like that. And I was so lazy. It's partly my fault. You all know it's Uncle Shakes. So, it was partly my fault because I did not finish on time. So, um, he left. And then now he says, let me take Uber. It's going to cost me $61 and I'm not in the mood to spend that. I'm too tired to drive to Oakland. And the worst part is driving to Oakland is parking. Parking is the problem. 
that's why I didn't want to go. So I was like, nah, I'm not going anymore. So yeah, that's that. And um, now I'm just going to head to Costco, get some few things, then maybe head to um, the mall or so. I'll let you know, okay? Guys, I just decided to stop and watch my car. <laughs> So I'm in Costco. I took off my glasses. Um, I'm just getting a few grocery items. Nothing too much here because Costco stuff, you all know it's too big. And um, all of the things I need a lot of, that's what I'm getting from here. But let's go. I'm still shy holding this camera. It feels weird. <laughs> Makes me feel like I'm mad. <laughs> but anyways, for the love of you guys, that's why if you've not subscribed to my channel, like, what are you waiting for? What? Go well, subscribe now. Thank you. Click the button down below. Right there. Right down there, okay? been telling y'all I need to have more protein so um, actually I like to say I like milk and um, I just found this one right here the one that has 30 grams of protein because we're gonna be switching up one meal for protein um, shake so or smoothie so that's why I got this M-I-S-S -S. okay <laughs> so I noticed I have a couple of my subscribers that are not from the US so guys if you live in Africa or somewhere welcome to life in the US back home when you go for grocery you get the boys at the shop that will help you put it in your car you have people but here hmm, do eat your damn selves and worst of it all, Costco doesn't give bags. Oh, I forgot bags. Let me just put them in this trash bag. Here, do the things yourself. I know my lightning is bad. So. So guys, I'm done with Costco. I am supposed to go to Walmart for the rest of my shopping. But I've not had anything to eat since I ate breakfast. Since I ate breakfast. So let's go. I really wanted to go to Red Lobster. But the Red Lobster that I told you guys I wanted to go to um, across the street from here. It's permanently closed. Like, come on now, Red Lobster. So, um... And I'm packed under the sun. Oh, let's get going. So I'll need um I'll need to go to Cheesecake Factory. That's what's close by. Uh because the next one is far away. I really don't like Cheesecake Factory that much, but I don't know. I just wanted to have like a semi-formal fine dining experience, but let's see. After waiting for 
30 minutes or so finally got a table and i'm outside like the restaurant is so full it is so 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 freaking full um, yeah and if you're new to my channel well i like to go on um self dates if you look down on my channel you see a couple of videos where i've been on uh several self dates experience and sometimes i just like to go out by myself you know and besides today my son did not want to come out with me so he prefers to play video games rather than go out with his mom well he didn't know i was coming here because if he knew he'll definitely want to come but yeah i'm here just having my me time i wish i had enough time i would have gone to see the movie barbie or so but i don't know yet but for now we are at cheesecake factory so i usually get the same things that i already know when i come to a restaurant but today let's try something different i got this uh, coconut mojito so let me see if i like it Oh, I got this girl on the phone. Say hi. Hello. Say hello. Girl, I don't know how I feel about this. It tastes a lot like, has a lot of basil taste in it. Mm. Mm. I don't know. It's okay, I'm not getting it again. That's all I know. It's okay. Wait, it doesn't even have alcohol in it. I didn't taste alcohol in it. Like, I didn't taste alcohol. But yes. So, on my dates, I usually call people to let them say I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> no, just kidding. But yeah. Anyways, let me talk to this girl and I'll be back, okay? My food is here and I think I've had it before and I'm not like, uh, about it. <laughs> Try it together. Because, I don't know, it doesn't look appetizing. Hopefully it tastes good. It doesn't taste so bad. Let me enjoy my food in peace and I'll talk to you. So hey guys, hello and welcome. It's um Sunday and um yeah today's the 29th no the 30th of this of July and um I didn't go to church okay I woke up late a little bit because I woke up at around 8 30 and I had to cook because yesterday I told you I was having a lazy day so I had to cook and um, make breakfast so now my friend is here Shegu Uncle Shegs is here and because he built out of me yesterday but okay so now I'm going downstairs to do a little bit of my makeup. I'm going down to my studio and then I'm going to have my first guest, Uncle Shakes. So Shakes and I, we're going to have a sit down, cheat, chat, talk about real estate and all that good stuff. Okay. And you will see that video. So let's go. I uh, know black people don't know that. If, if you're going to start to please those black people tell them it's 12 or something because they're not coming on time you just don't know time guys so it's eight o'clock we're done like whatever time we start but eight o'clock we are done we out you can take it to the club we can start you know we can go lead some more inspiration and maybe we like ask the party so it's um it could go whatever you say sir so guys okay see i just finished filming with shakes like it was wonderful the video is fire like ugh. we said we were gonna talk for 20 minutes but guys we could not stop talking and it was amazing so say thanks to hey shake there's more coming your way there's more coming he has events that we're working on setting up 
you know, because man, real estate is really, really big and it's really, really good. Everything is. Everything. Think about it. Everything needs some sort of space. Of if course. If it's a grocery store, you know, you sell cars. Of course. Everything you need to do, you need some sort of space. You need space. <laughs> and right now, the way the world is like places like um, pair space and all. I mean, you can cash out any time. See, if this was my house, I would not be asking questions like, do I need permission? You know, you know, so come on, man. I think, I think I need to take the bold step. Well, guys, it was really nice. I don't know if I have anything else that I'm going to do today. I don't really know. But, oh, I need to sell also because he's buying stuff for his wife. So let me go sell. Bye-bye. A person you know and you like very well. See, it doesn't matter. It's finisher. It doesn't matter. It matters. Love is great. Marriage is the eye opener. When you get home, that is when you will know that it's not all. It's not spiritual 24-7. Marry a man that you know and you like. Marry your friend. Marry someone you can associate with on all levels and not be ashamed. Genesis 2.25, and they were both naked, the man and his wife, and they were not ashamed. Number three, marry someone that knows your faults and accepts you just as you are. Proverbs 17.17, 17, a friend loves at all times, and a brother is born for adversity. A true friend is somebody that knows where you stink, and yet is faithful. Someone number four that loves you enough to tell you the truth you don't even want to hear. Yep. That's Everybody may clap for you, but there should be somebody that I call your confronter who can pull you aside and tell you the, the way you throw temper tantrums is killing. Mm -hmm. Someone that can tell you you are rude. She heard that was our uh, pastor Funke. This woman has changed my life in so many ways like being young getting married and it's not easy and listening to somebody like like her you know it just gives you that um assurance you know that guidance everything you know i really love her i mean not every day i agree with some of what she says and some of those things i usually do not agree with she has refuted them but for the most part you know she says it like it is and as it is supposed to be said. So I like her. Thank you, Pastor Funke. Guys, I think I'm going to end this particular vlog here because I am not doing anything interesting anymore besides work and editing and, you know, coordinating stuff. So that's it. That's what I'm going to be doing for the next few days. Yeah, but I hope you enjoyed this video spending my weekend with me going on a self-date and learning about marriage you know i don't know do you guys want to hear me talk about marriage especially um long distance marriage because that is my current predicament right now you know and it's been very challenging but fulfilling at the same time so let me know what you guys want to see okay and thank you so much for stopping by and if you have not subscribed what are you waiting for like come on now I've been giving you back to back so please go subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next one bye for now